A message from the Universal House of Justice to the believers in the Cradle of the Faith. January 10th, 2010. Read by John Iron for VoicesDivine.com. Dearly loved friends, as the date set for the trial of the former members of the Yaran approaches, certain officials have made statements over the past few days claiming that the motive for the arrest of ten friends on January 3rd, 2010 lay not in their membership to the Baha'i community, but in their involvement in organizing the events that occurred on the day of Ashura. The people of Iran, indeed, the people of the world, and the community of nations are familiar with the principles of the Baha'i faith, the conduct of its adherents, and the history of its development. They know, therefore, that such a claim is baseless. All fair-minded people would attest that Baha'is, wherever they reside, labor shoulder to shoulder with their compatriots for the progress and prosperity of their nation. Baha'is are known to rely on the framework of the law in defense of their own rights as well as those of others. They aspire to virtues of truthfulness and honesty, eschew violence and conflict, and avoid all manner of partisan politics. Yet, regrettably, those whose inner vision is dimmed by the veils of religious prejudice have conspired to create false accusations so as to provide justification to the Iranian people for their acts of oppression against you, seemingly unaware that such actions ultimately vitiate the perpetrator's credibility. We take comfort in knowing that you are cognizant of the operation of divine forces. You realize that within his grasp are held the reins of all things. You call on the spiritual powers born of such understanding to transcend enmity and oppression. Staunch and immovable, you have won the admiration of the world as you have continued to discharge your duties with consummate wisdom. Our hearts overflow with love and admiration for each and every one of you. We raise our hands in supplication to Almighty God, beseeching Him to safeguard you and to aid you in promoting the interests of the cause and in serving your fellow countrymen. Signed, The Universal House of Justice.